I'm Lindsay and I'm an RN. Lindsay, I want to share something with you really quick. Hi, I'm Maxie and uh, Lindsay is my nurse. And I'm Linda and Maxie is my mother. The first time I met uh, Lindsay, um, she came to my house and um, we got to talking and we found out we had a lot of things in common. Sometimes she just seemed like she knew what was bothering me before I even told her. She was interested in the way I felt. So that helped her to understand me and me to understand her. It's really great to know that you can rely on someone to do their job and to do it really kindly and wonderfully and um, have my mother's best interest at heart. As a family member, it gave me a strong sense of comfort that someone was taking that kind of care of my mother. She's number one on my book. Lindsay, I want you to know how much I appreciate the care, the kindness that you've always given to my mother. I'm a nurse, but sometimes I have to be the daughter first. So it's good to have someone who I trust um, to look at her as a nurse and to give me information so I know what to do better for my mother. Thank you very much for being who you are. Thank you, Lindsay, for all the things that you've done for me. You're very kind and understanding, and I'm glad to have you as a friend and a nurse. I love Maxie. I love her so much. She's just truly special. And she needs to know that she has had such an impact in my life. Because I get to listen to her and her tell me about what's going on with her, and then I get to talk about how I've gotten through things, it just makes my day brighter. I'm sure I'll be calling her very soon after seeing this. How can you not like have that that sweet spot for people? All kinds of different personalities, all kinds of different backgrounds. Being a nurse is definitely having skills and having knowledge. But compassion and kindness is it's key. Just them knowing you're there for them. I truly believe that that's, that in itself can be healing.